Hello, and thank you for stopping by today to view Google Drive and Workfront Integrated by Put It Forward. What is this, and how does this integration really work? Well, first off, this is native level integration, meaning the sharing of data is made to act seamlessly. We're capable of doing so because between these two applications, we've made everything event based. Example given, when you create any document type, let's say a project, it will create and sync along with the predefined folder structure. As well, all global assets and file controls are maintained within Google. So the same file and permissions from Google are utilized within Workfront when accessing the documents. The pertinent need for enterprise-wide data automation is evolving the way we work. What is that need exactly? Well, we can no longer strain ourselves utilizing linear data forwarding tools as showcased on the left. We need a 360 degree understanding of any business lifecycle within your enterprise as showcased from the right. Let's take a look at a demo recording of the integration. Now that we've jumped inside of Workfront, we've actually created a demo project just for this. As we can see right there, it's actually loading up a version of Put It Forward called Put It Forward Foresight. It's actually just opened up different folders, folder types, and folder structures, as well as the documents contained within them. This is all accessible through Workfront via Google Drive through Put It Forward. We've just downloaded a copy of your document. As you can see, it's just a general PDF, but allows us to understand the capability of what happens when we download any piece of data or document store access through this. If we click a link, we're actually transported instantly over to Google Drive, where we can upload, create new documents, edit documents, spreadsheets, slideware, whatever it is, this is all accessible between the two by Put It Forward. We're actually creating a new document. Let's name it test one. And as well, let's fill in some basic text inside of the document itself. Once we've done so, let's actually clarify or designate exactly where we want to save this document within our Google Drive folder structure. Now that we've seen that the document has been saved properly, let's actually jump inside of Put It Forward Foresight and let's enter into that folder that we saved the document under. And voila, instantly, the document has been saved over to here, containing not only the appropriate folder file structure, the name, but as well, the text within it. I'd like to thank you for stopping by to view today's video. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out to us. As well, visit us at www.putitforward.com where you can view a full range of data resources about integration and orchestration, including a full video demonstration library, information about other resources pertaining to white papers, eBooks, and as well, any info sheets so that way you can make the right decision when it comes to orchestration. We hope to hear from you soon. Have a wonderful day.